Hey guys, this is Sam, and today we're going to be comparing two Apple A8 processors. The first is going to be found in the brand new, recently released iPod Touch 6th generation, and the second Apple A8 chip is going to be found, of course, in the iPhone 6 here on the right. iPod Touch is going to be on the left, and we're going to see which one is faster. Now we're going to start the test right now, and you might be wondering what the point of this is if they're the same chip. Obviously, they're going to be the same speed, right? At least that's what we would think right off the bat. However, I and I think you will be very shocked by the results that this test will show because, as it turns out, one device is actually going to finish a little bit quicker than the other. Even though both devices are running an A8 chip, you can see that the iPhone 6 finished just about now, and very short after, the iPod Touch 6th generation also was finished running its Geekbench processor benchmark. Now the scores we just got are a total of 1386 for the single core score on the iPod Touch 6th generation and 1608 for a score on the iPhone 6. And we're going to see the same trend for the multi-core score. Over on the iPod Touch 6th generation we've got a total of 2446 for the multi-core score and we've got actually 2879 on the iPhone 6 which is 400 points on the multi-core score better than the brand new iPod Touch. So even though both of these devices are running the same quote A8 chip, they actually each have a different clock rate. For the iPod Touch 6th generation, it's clocked at 1.13 GHz, where on the iPhone 6 here, it's clocked at 1.40 GHz. Now obviously 0.27 GHz isn't something crazy by any means. In, in everyday use, you're probably not even going to notice if you're using an iPhone 6 or an iPod Touch 6th generation. They both have A8 chips. They are both two incredibly powerful devices. But if you are doing something more graphics intense, if you're doing something that requires more power, based on this benchmark, it's going to run better on the iPhone 6. If you enjoyed watching this benchmark comparison of the iPhone 6 and the iPod Touch 6th generation, Make sure you hit that like button down below, and of course subscribe for more content similar to this. This has been Sam with iUpdateOS. Hope you guys had a great day, and I will talk to you in my next video.